Welcome to Vancouver, British Columbia, the true north strong and free, where every hour is happy hour and every night is ladies night. Every time I hear someone say my fair city's name, it reminds me of the most important day in Canadian history. How important, you ask? Extremely important. Friday, July 12th, 2013. That was the day a certain extreme society of extreme dudes saw the most extreme international wrestle dude party. The only words you could use to describe it were extreme extremeness. Friday, July 12th, 2013. The day the International Society of Extreme Dudes and Extremeness are having their show, Big Dick Wrestling Universe 2, Best of the Super Dicks. That's right, one night only, featuring all of your favorites from the I Suck Sticks multiverse and more. How much more? Extremely more! Now I know what you're thinking. All this extreme at the same time is going to make me hungry. I went to this one show one time and I got a free calzone. Calzones? What kind of piss ant pawn shop do you think we're running here? We got us an all-you-can-eat buffet stocked with the finest meats and cheeses imported from countries you couldn't pronounce, three different kinds of pasta salad, and seven different kinds of ranch dressing. We also got one of those sluts that lets you eat sushi off our naked body. A sushi slut! We got a bar with various old lictors served in strange containers and a bartender that does that gay shit with the bottles like Tom Cruise in that gay movie. But don't go filling up on slut sushi. You gotta save room for dessert. What's for dessert, you ask? Why we have a make your own Sunday buffet brought to you by our friends at Lucerne. Lucerne, shut the fuck up and eat your ice cream. You'll be eating that ice cream, enjoying one of the greatest halftime shows known to man. So extreme, it makes the Super Bowl look like a paper plate. It'll be jam-packed with celebrities, the fun ones, strippers, cockfights, donkey shows, cake, booty ring toss girls, an oxygen bar with all the free air you can breathe, cosplay enthusiasts, a Dance Dance Revolution tournament, CFL Hall of Famer Lou Pasaglia will be signing autographs, leather daddies, and a watermelon filled with 190 proof grain alcohol, as well as musical guest Celine Dion performing a duet with a hologram of Old Dirty Bastard, as well as the band Crocus reuniting after 20 years to perform their hit Tonight Long Stick Go Boom. And to top it all off, the comedic stylings of one Mr. Polly Shore. Yeah, that's right. We got the weasel. Buddy. You don't want to miss this show, folks. Don't believe me? Let's ask some people that went to last year's show. Hey, was last year's show not the greatest spectacle in entertainment history? Yes. <sighs> Would you kill yourself if for some reason you had to miss this year's show? Yes! Would you give up your mortality to be able to relive last year's show over and over again, similar to Kerwood Smith in that made-for-TV movie 1201 PM, even if it meant you would never die? Yeah, 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 yeah. Are you as hard as I am right now? Yeah, whatever. Remember when I told you that it was one day only? Well, I lied to you. But it's the best kind of lie. Why? Because we have so much extreme awesome that we need to do it over three days. Three days! That means three times the amount of free oxygen, dirt McGirt, and wheezing the juice. So mark this day off on your calendar. Mark a week off, because as for a shindig this big, you're gonna need to recuperate. Hell, I know a British kid that came to last year's couldn't walk for a week. And send this video to all your friends, because it's a computer virus. Take it from me. I'm a doctor, Dr. Von Luge. Scorpion Von Luge!